Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for your great support always. I'm so grateful for your continued support to this channel. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. Now, Kenyans, I told you very clear that Donald Trump is going to shake the world. His victory is something important not only to the U.S. people, but to the world. As you speak, Trump, before even taking over, because he is going to be sworn in next year, January, but he has declared that they are going to recognize a female and a male family whereby they will not be forced to adopt that culture that we were being forced to adopt. You saw that was a big problem, not only in Kenya, but other parts of countries across the world, where we were being told the same gender, should live together as a wife and a husband. The same to other gender. So Donald Trump is very clear and he is coming out to say that no country should come out and force its citizen to change their status of gender or rather you tell your citizens that it is a crime or a mistake for you to be a female or a male. So you must uh, have transgender. And so Donald Trump is very clear on this. When he's going to take over January, these things are going to be stopped. No man should participate in a game of women or women participating in a game of men. Donald Trump has come out to say enough is enough. They are going to follow the right path. And those who are terrifying some countries in Africa or elsewhere, that you must adopt this culture so that you can be funded. It is over, Kenyans. I'm telling you. I want you to listen to Donald Trump. But before we watch, as you always do, ensure you like the video. When you like the video, you automatically support the work that I'm doing in this channel. Because sometimes you watch the video and forget liking the video. So this is just a reminder. As you watch, ensure you like the video. Let us listen to Donald Trump. As part of our new credentialing body for teachers, we will promote positive education about the nuclear family, the roles of mothers and fathers, and celebrating rather than erasing the things that make men and women different and unique. I will ask Congress to pass a bill establishing that the only genders recognized by the United States government are male and female, and they are assigned at birth. The bill will also make clear that Title IX prohibits men from participating in women's sports, and we will protect the rights of parents from being forced to allow their minor child to assume a gender which is new and an identity without the parent's consent. The identity will not be new and it will not be without parental consent. No serious country should be telling its children that they were born with the wrong gender, a concept that was never heard of in all of human history. Nobody's ever heard of this, what's happening today. It was all when the radical left invented it just a few years ago. Under my leadership, this madness will end. Thank you very much. So he's very clear on what he's going to do. I know some people will not be happy, but the truth is, as I've always been saying this channel, that no one should force me to adopt a culture that is not even recognized in the Bible, or in the perspective way of Christianity, there's nothing like that. 
In the perspective way of Muslims, there's nothing like that. So it is just a culture that is being forced to us so that we can have fundings. We rather don't have those fundings, but not to follow such kind of cultures. And again, what will follow is about this issue of IT. Watch the space, I'm telling you. Trump will come out and stop that funding because it is not benefiting them. In fact, he has said that going forward, they're going to ensure that those who are homeless are going to be sorted out. That there is no law that is going to allow anyone to take advantage of their streets, their beautiful streets in the U.S. To install their tents there because they are homeless. Some are going to be rehabilitated. Some are going to be given. Uh, they are going to be sorted out. And that is the government, even our country, Kenya, needs. And I know Donald Trump is just is not just with words. He's going to do it. By January, things are going to be hot in the U.S. And those bureaucrats or the so-called deep states are going to face the wrath of Donald Trump. I'm telling you. Those who are harvesting money in certain part of far-fetched or how can I call them? Deals. Donald Trump came out very clear that he's going to stop it. So those who are happy squandering the, pub, uh, the public resources because they want to get funding on, towards the money they never made was a how. So my president, William Ruto, you must know that some things are going to be stopped. Kama mulukuwa unapata pesa because of such kind of culture, ati to adopt your culture, you imeisha. Sa hitu naambiwa na Donald Trump, lazima to respect male and female. Yo maneno sujui yo ingine, no. So I, I think for Donald Trump, it's very clear. And he has simply simplified it. And anyone who doesn't understand, then wait for the wrath 2025, January. Because Donald Trump is going to be inaugurated on January. And I know some individuals are even trembling. And that is why our President William Ruto writes to call him kujionyesha na kujipendekeza. He must know kama kuna deal walikuwa nafanya behind the scene, Donald Trump is not that man. This man is a truthful man. I'm telling you. I know some people are seeing Donald Trump as a man who doesn't understand anything. Who is crazy. Or is running out of his mind. But again, sometimes I've listened to Donald Trump. So, you always speak the facts. You know? But some people will say, oh, this man is crazy. But he's saying the truth. So I'm happy. Let us have our cultures. Yenye tulizaliwa na Tusifosiwa atilazimu uadopti Uadopti do sasa upewe fundings That is it Ladies and gentlemen What do you think? Drop your opinion at the comment section below Otherwise thank you so much because of your support Please consider subscribing, liking, commenting and sharing this video Bye bye till you meet in another video